I'm West. That's Lucy. And we just took the sickest road trip ever. West goes wandering. I don't I don't want to bury the lead here <clears throat> as my uh generation might say. Um spoil the ending, spoiler alert. Uh when I say sick, I mean I have a cold. It's not COVID. But it sucks. Um, it's it's a two penny whore for sure. Um, <clears throat> and I was sick the whole road trip. So now that all the younger generation is gone and the clickbait title is over with, I think you're really gonna enjoy this. <clears throat> I hope. If not, I didn't either. So tomato, tomato. Dear Mom, I'm writing this to just catch you up on what I've been up to. Of course I'm taking care of myself. I definitely didn't stop at a convenience store to live off of convenience store food for the next several days. And I haven't been trapped inside my tiny truck for several days because I'm sick and don't want to go on my hikes. I am getting Lucy out just not as far as either of us would like to go. Despite my best efforts, I am not falling in love with Arizona. And so I plotted the quickest course out of this state back towards Lake Mead, a place that I have truly come to love. However, I did break all of my nomad rules for traveling. In my first camp, under a bridge where trolls belong, it looked like it was the high school party pad, and it was a Saturday night, and I did not want to be next to high school party padders. And so, I traveled again from there, another several hours, and this time up a dirt road to get to a camp that was marked very clearly, no camping. So I bit the bullet and I find myself back in Kings Canyon at Lake Mead, fully six hours of driving to get here, uh, if not longer. Shockingly, I am happy and I know my, my health and the weather will both improve and my adventures will continue. Until next time.